Hello everyone, I'm Anna here. Welcome back to my channel. Um, as you guys know, I'm still in China, Nanjing, and when I'm not homeschool, I spend my first grade to sixth grade in school. Then I have a very fun story. Stick around and listen to it. What story is it? When the school bell rang, then it means you're over class. But our class is still quiet. Why? Everyone is still in their seat doing their homework. Not classwork, but homework. It is by the teacher, which you need to go to home to work about it. So, if they are doing homework, what did they go back home play? Of course not. They go back home to write tomorrow's classwork. Then. In tomorrow's classwork, they will do homework again. So this is turn around and around. Long story short, when they go back home, until 10 p.m. to 11 p.m., they can't sleep. This is pretty tough. And I ask a question: Why did the people do this? I actually didn't know. When I was fifth grade, I didn't know who started this. Then the whole class are doing like this because if you do not work about it. You can't be the first one, or say you will be the last one. This is must, right? This is pretty tough, isn't it? Then I ask me, why are people doing this? Is this good? Can they be focused? And I feel really tired if I do about this. Then I started homeschool this year, and I didn't do it like this, and of course. And then I know the answer when I read books and start in class in the summer. What? Hmm. I will. I draw a picture. You can look at it. Okay, now everyone, let's see here. First, this is one hundred percent focus, and this is the time. And um, this is fifty percent. And what if this is eight hours? And if you are at school, then you learn for two hours, and then you have done. You can't focus again. So this is four hours. This is two hours, and here. Look, if you are at school, you can only. Focus by 100%, and the rest of the time you are lower than 50%. So how can you do? Right, this is actually pretty pop. So if it's looking like this, how can you do? You only can focus two hours. Then I know a good idea. It is Pachumo. What is it? You might hear about it. It's like a tomato time. It is 25 minutes per pachimo. Then I have a clock like this. If you have 25 minutes, then bell rings. You need to have a five-minute rest, and you have four pachimos, which is 100 minutes. Then you can have a 30-minute rest. Yes. So if you are doing like this, and if you have four groups. This is one group of pachimo. I always do four groups of pachimo, which means I always work for eight hours. What is this could be? What is pachimum technique? It is if you are go and down, then you got up and go and down, then got up, then go and down, then got up, then go and down. So, which means. That if you have a thirty minutes rest, then you can work for eight hours straight. Five pachimos. Right? Isn't this a very good idea? Yes. So you can work for eight hours, and you are not very tired. Then you are one hundred percent focused. At actually. So this is really good. If you like about it, you can use it. And if you like my video, I will I will have some good videos in the future too. You can like, subscribe. If you have some questions, you can comment down below. I will answer you in the next video. Goodbye. I'm Anna here.